Yantif, some Yudbeis of Gimel Tammuz. just want to share a few stories about Yudbeis Tammuz. Reb Zalman Luchman writes that when the Fidik Rebbe came Yudbeis Tammuz, first Yudbeis Tammuz in Kastrama, so when he came home, he shared a story that happened a few years before. Yudbeis Tammuz, Tov Rishnun Dalet. Fidik Rebbe was then, it was his birthday, turning 14. He was in Dachau, he was in the country with his father, with the Rebbe Nishma Zayden. And the Rebbe Shab gave a mashke for his birthday. So it's a Sevachayim for his birthday. So the Rebbe Shabbatz was there. Shabbatz was the Fidik Rebbe's Vachanach. So the Rebbe Shabbatz asked the Rebbe Rashab, where did you uh, see this? Did you see this by your father or by your Zayda? That uh, it wasn't customary by the Rabbeim to do this. So the Rebbe Rashab said, Falosach of Mir, rely on me. And the Fidik Rebbe and the story says, and I've and I'm, I have gratitude to him, I'm thankful to him. So, Reb Zalman Duchman writes that he was in Yechidus and he told the Rebbe the story. And the Rebbe asked him, Who does he think he said, Ich bin Dainbar, to who? Who is he grateful to? So he said, He thought, he says the story, he thought that the Fidik Rebbe is thankful to the Rebbe Rashab. So the Rebbe said, No, he thinks that the Fidik Rebbe is thankful to the Rashbats. Because through that, he got Chadr Shbatz, had his apprehension about the Lachayim, and the Rebbe Shab said, Falasich of Mir, and that was the, when that came, the nest of Yud Beis Tamas. Just uh, another, another story of them for, about Yud Beis Tamas. Chadr Fagin uh, once said a story that Tafresh uh, Zayn by the Fidik Rebbe Shevet Brachas, when the Rebbe Shab made the yeshiva to Chetmimim, so a few Balabatim came to the Rebbe Shab and asked them, what was built to Uftam with their yeshiva? What are you looking to accomplish exactly? So the Rebbe Shab told them, that this you'll see, you'll see in 30, in the Reisikar, you'll see in 30 years from now, you'll see what I wanted to accomplish. And he concluded, in 30 years from now, Tafrish Pezayin, and the Saladim said, it's nefesh for Yiddishkeit, but uh, so this brought with it, and that was the Kavanah to Chetmimim, to set up an army of Yidin that are Misa Nefesh for, for for Yiddish for Tehra Mitzvahs. Just one uh, last story, um, also from Reb Zalman Duchman writes, that the uh, Gimel Tammuz, before the Fidik Rebbe went to Kastrama, the Fidik Rebbe came home in Leningrad, in Petersburg, he came home for a few hours for that day, till he, till, till he took the train to Kastrama. So there's a bunch of stories that happened that day. One of the things that happened is that the Rebbe Rashab asked him, as a brother-in-law, if they learned Chassidus while the Fidik Rebbe was, in, was away, was in jail, arrested. So they said, he answered that they, they said Tehillim. And obviously, um, everyone knows that the Takana of saying Tehillim after davening every day, every day that was Chassidus of Zionists and the Fidik Rebbe asked everyone to do it. And uh, when the Fidik Rebbe was arrested, that was the Tzatel that they found on the Fidik Rebbe's desk, on the Fidik Rebbe's table, was this Bakasha that everyone should say to Shir, the Shir Tehillim Hayemi, the way it's Nechlek for Yimei HaChidosh throughout, and that's what they did, they kept on saying to them. So the Fidik Rebbe said that he wrote, the Fidik Rebbe wrote the Maimorim, the meaning the Maimorim that the Fidik Rebbe said that Yoshvuas, that he didn't, get, he didn't get a chance to finish writing before the arrest, until they took away from him the pencil. And uh, later, a few hours later, the Fidik Rebbe gave them to learn, that they should be able to learn, he gave out through our Rebbe, he gave our Rebbe the the memorium that they should be able to learn, and talk on the memorium were written, that it was written, the mice, it was, it was written on Yutasiv and on Chosiv, and meaning the days that Fidika was in jail, and those days he wrote, he wrote, he wrote those, those two memorium. So just uh, interesting, obviously then everyone said to Hillam, and that was the Fidika of his big kachan, the Takana then, and that was the Tzatel they found then, and it was a very big kachan saying to Hillam, and still the Fidika had this expectation of Chosidim, that uh, really they should have uh, invest, they should have uh, been been learning chassidus, and that's why that's what he did till he, till they till they took away the pencil from him. That's a little I think connected with the story I just said before about what Chacha said that the kavon of ten chetmimim, which is the yeshiva where they learn chassidus, was we saw in the yudbeis tamas pezayin thirty years of tafresh nazayin. Chaim, we should um, take a year off in yudbeis tamas to strengthen ourselves. Sign the kima takana the fidikerab the balagula, the shirechitas. Also, you should Rambam and also on the Iker and Lumadach Siddhis.